together? She wishes. No, it's one of these uh, beer flogging. Sorry I asked. This is what happens. Four models. <laughs> protein deficiencies. Sharing a shower. <laughs> they shed a four, you know, $4 Christmas sweater. Guys, guess what? I just made a breakthrough with a student. Yeah, it's true. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, Jess? <laughs> You know we love you, we don't support you, but when you do things like this, I'm sorry. Bull. Okay. Bull? Oh, bull. Annoyance bull. It's just not satisfying. <laughs> I think it is. Okay, you said you had a breakthrough. It's just a whole new world teaching adults. This week, I gave them an assignment. I said, write whatever you want, just load it up with descriptive imagery. My fluffy pillow, my yellowy fluffy pillow, next to my dog, my hairy dog, my beloved hairy dog, while I diddle myself. Excellent. He was a merman. He was the last of his kind, and he needed a mother for his merchild. He was not a mer gentleman. Can't wait to hear more. I just can't connect with them, and I don't know why. Look, Jess, you can't teach people how to write. Not true. I say that as a writer. No. Okay. okay, let's refocus. Um, <laughs> no, let's talk I can't. about the um, four <laughs> classifications of conflict. Okay, we talked about it last week. It's in the workbook. Um, anybody want to help me? Four classifications of conflict. Anybody? Anybody? So no one it's decided for office hours, screen. and I just want you to know that you can talk to me about anything, oh, yes. anything at all. What are you doing? Well, Damn man, you look good in your doctors. What? Nothing happened. I'm Julius Pepperwood. Let it go. That's me. Whoops. Why did you do that? The wind. Everything all right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm next time, I'm right? What's happening? Right Sorry, now? Edgar. Oh. Um, I really loved your story. Um, I wanted to give you some notes. Is there any time you could come in? Oh, uh, office hours? Yeah, that'd be really cool. I'm really excited. Um, I'm available anytime. So. I'll check my calories. Yeah. Can't get service right now. Wednesday, I gotta go to the third store. Uh, what about Wednesday afternoon? He's my uncle. Hey, listen, Did you take it, though? I know my pogo is. Instead of dance kind of like a sea snake. Yeah, not even close to it. What are you talking I know this is it, man. Oh, so pogo is like some, something about you that it's everybody knows about eyebrows. you? Well, look. What's my pogo? Ah! They're gone. Nick, you've gone way too far. Way too far. Well, if you're here for Edgar's notebook, you're too late. Where's the notebook? Nick, what's my one rule? Is it to not steal your yarn? Don't steal my yarn, man. Don't steal my yarn, man. Oh, look at what was inside of his notebook. What are you doing yarn. in class, Nick? Weapons dripping with blood? That is not a doodle. What are you, the doodle police? This is not a doodle police, are they? Really? I can't believe you still don't believe me. <laughs> Jessica. Exhibit D. He did this. I'm going to Edgar's house. I'm looking for more proof. No, Nick, you're not spying on the one Babe. student that I have a connection with. I have the address right here. Hey, no. Give me the... No. I have the address memorized. Fine, then I'm coming too. To bail you out of jail when you get arrested for trespass. Fine, then you'll see that I was right. Fine. And you'll also see who gets there first. Maybe we should take one car. Just like for the environment. Yeah, that makes sense. We can drive together. That's fine. 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 But we're still yelling yeah, at each other. Yeah, it's fine. We can drive it's my mole, isn't it? Well, consider it gone. Game, set, pogo. Chill out, man. It's not your mole. Oh, just tell me. This is the worst. No, this is not the worst, Schmidt. The worst is actually knowing. Knowing that your friends sit around every single night talking about your pogo. It's a pogo. Those brows don't freak you out? No, I'm saying worse. A pogo is what your friends talk about when you leave the room. Oh, like your barnacle toenails? Uh. <laughs> oh, shit. You guys talk about my toenails? <laughs> you never talk about your toenails, Schmidt. Now my toenails are a rugged, woodsy. I mean, I never wanted to. He can't even look at his face. Palm tree. But it's because I have a keratin surplus. I mean, 
I mean, they're not that bad. Look at these things. Ah! Smith! It looks like an open Swiss Army knife. Most of them are hard to open. It's really, really soft. I know, I know, I know. Well, just talk about what my pogo is. What's my pogo? Is it the way you say pan? Pan. Pan? Pan. Look, see. Pan? What is she trying to say? Pan or pen? I don't know. Calcified mongrel toes. Look at that. 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 Look Anything's got to go down the safe word. Nothing's oh, going to go down the safe word. And up. there's no pepper wood. Never get caught without a safe word. We're going to go with apricot. That's way too normal. We need to, like, go with something weird, like dragon slippers. What? I use apricot too much in my normal life. Why do you use apricots so much? What am I supposed to call them? Sweet tangy balls? Don't call them sweet tangy balls, Jesse. Well, that's why. Please. Now you know that you don't truly know it all. There I go, being a smart ass again. I mean, that that could be my photo. And then there was one. Oh, no, 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 I'm sure that you guys have stuff you laugh at. Maybe I don't know. You don't laugh about your photo, Nick. Yeah. We're worried about you. You're worried, worried about, about you. you. You're worried about you. You're not going to make it. Make it You're worried about you. In general, because you don't take care of yourself. Sometimes I'll crumple up vitamins and I'll put them in your food. We all take turns sneaking money into your pants pockets before we put them in the dryer. <laughs> you know what? I hope you're happy. The pogos are off. Loft dynamic is ruined. We worry about you. Wait, what was Cece's though? I thought she just. I even talk like a baby. You're still hot. That's all we're gonna talk about. I can't even a baby. Cut into these, please. Oh, her focus just said she's hot. I guess so. Yeah. Oh, okay. She was trying to say, what is, is it? Is it some smart ass? Smart ass. That's a stupid thing. Oh, 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 that's a dumb thing. Come on, it's the dumbest thing ever. Oh, oh that's a lot right there. How about you? with the situation right now. Okay. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is... This is, is that supposed bad. to be, um... Oh, Jess? No, oh, no, 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 God, I got it. Huh? Jesse wants to kill you! What? I'm in his shed right now, and there are drawings on the wall of you. And bloody weapons! And googly eyes! Googly eyes are actually kind of sexy, but that's what Jeff, I will not let you be in a room alone with this guy. You're the deer in his story. He wants to kill you. You're the deer. You're the deer. You're the deer. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm at school, and I, I'm doing office hours. Get out now. Okay, I'll just, I'll just keep it on the line, and then I'll say the um, <laughs> Wait, C the word, thing. okay? I'll just say it like, say apricots! Apricots! <laughs> good, good, yeah, that's what you say if you see it. Apricots, really, apricots! Oh no, okay, okay, stop it! He's there, okay! I thought it was gonna be dragon slippers! Is this a bad time? Or? No, 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 I just have a death grocer. Apricots! Apricots! He's got a death grocer. And <laughs> butter! I'm coming! I'm coming! Oh! Well, can't you open it from the inside then? He's like even near anything. Welcome gonna to Office Hours. Um. I found my ending. Yeah. It's pretty risky. I'm not sure I'm going to be able to get away with it. <laughs> Remember when you told me to base my characters on people from my own life? Well, I based one on you. So flattered. And then I realized that there was only one way for the story to end. You need to die. So when you say it like that... You said great literature is surprising. What's more surprising than killing your main character? What about this? Go with me. What if, um, what if uh, my character lives and the book just goes on? Imagine coming to the end of the book and then just finding a lot more book. Surprise. Um, this song, song is everywhere these days. Were you in my house? Okay, thank you. Goodbye. No, I, I gotta go. go. No. Right now. No. Apricot's leaving. Apricot's leaving. Oh, good. I'm so 
so happy you're alive. Okay, stay inside and lock the door. I'm so happy you're alive. I am going to protect you. Oh, always the mama. Helping out. Always. Burglar? This isn't a burglar. He's Julius Pepperwood from Chicago. Let's get him in the house. The DA's gonna have my badge to be. No! Get out of there! You kill him! You kill him! Your character in my graphic novel. He's an excellent artist. Okay, but your drawings, they don't have any eyes. Hey, he can't eyes. draw eyes. It's weird. There's a reason for everything. I can't oh, draw eyes. Eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Hey, Whoa. Hey, take this as hey, a compliment, man. pal. Your stories are so real. Well, it's because what you taught me. You listen? Well, of course I listen. You're a good teacher. Until you thought I was a murderer and you broke into my shed. Aww. You were my favorite student until I thought you were a murderer. Yeah. Night. It's not you, Jess. She was small in stature but non spunk and a super annoying know it all. It's still here. Evening. Hello. Oh, bacon. Where the hell did you come from? I came from my room. No, I didn't hear the pitter patter of your disgusting feet. Cut my toenails. Yeah, the soaking really worked. Look at that. They're gorgeous now. Went down a full shoe size. Guys, fire! Oh, oh my god! 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 <laughs> so sorry. Oh, you put up your pup tent in front of the fire. It's involuntary. It is a combination of <laughs> adrenaline and great circulation. And I'd appreciate it if you don't just pop me randomly. That's weird in the. When Winston runs, here he comes. Parts while he's running. Yes! <laughs> new pogo. Oh, we got a great new pogo. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was episode 14 of New Girl and another funny episode. Funny, funny episode right there. I love the the um, um what do you call it? The classic misunderstanding right there. Uh misreading the whole thing there. And then but then the surprise at the end was that that wasn't his mom. Was I told totally was like it's always the moms that's getting it. Uh they were together. So that's, um, instead of having the, the murder creepy factor, you just got the creepy creepy factor that's going on on there. And, uh, you know, hey, no disrespect. Shout Do out. You. Shout out to anybody over there who, who like the older, older and younger together, you know, like super age difference. Um, but that worked for me for this episode. But, so what was in the bag? I guess it was I pancake toys. mix or No, I think toys. it was like sex toys uh, or something. Okay. She was like, he was like, I'm going to go get the bag. I'm going to get the bag. Yeah, all right. So that made sense there. And then, you know, all the, the drawings, yeah. And then they crossed it with the kid going to talk to Jess. And then it, it just, that, okay. That, that, that was really good. But Nick, Nick held it down in this episode right here. Um, very funny. Very, very funny. And then the Winston side over there, that was funny as hell too. Found out another word, Pogo. Never heard of it before, mm -hmm. but I guess that's what is the word for when you know they talk the trait that everyone talks about yeah you about a pogo right? trait i don't yeah. i really don't get it somebody explain it to me but okay uh another good episode uh can't wait to see another one yeah so definitely the highlight was the trying to discover whether he's a murderer or not and nick being obsessed with that i thought was especially yeah. good him creating his you know um anonymous or his uh, different personality as far as going into the class was hilarious too so all of that really worked for me and as far as the pogo goes the one about Nick was also my favorite because it was so sad they were like we don't even laugh at your pogo <laughs> and like they're like sprinkling vitamins in his food yeah. and sneaking the, the, money, sneaking the money into his jeans before they go into the wash was so classic to me we so he you, just bro. thinks that he has extra money they say oh shit but they're sneaking it in yeah. there because they don't think he's gonna make it oh, um and then I loved how they take then him trying to address his pogo by getting up and making himself breakfast and then just struggling not to be the know-it-all. Uh -huh. So that just, the dynamic of all that worked really, really well for me. I think Winston's was also just 
naturally hilarious. There wasn't much effort having to be put in that space, but just the pogo they chose for him was just really, really funny. Yeah. Um, I think Schmitz was the weakest, probably Schmidt and Cece's. I think Cece's was just that she's hot, which she was ultimately trying to get a different pogo for right. herself, which I thought was great. And then Schmitz just having long claws is just goofy. Yeah. Um, because we haven't had that come up once. No, so one, like yeah. that doesn't that didn't really align, yeah. I think, with his character. But all in all, really entertaining episode. Alright, well look, thank you guys again for watching another Real Talk Reaction for New Girl Season 2, Episode 13. And until next time, no, 14, I'm sorry. Peace.